uh, these niggas on ESPN, like Shannon Sharp and uh, uh, oh, yeah. even Kendrick Perkins now, like, you don't think he got these yeah. niggas on payroll? Like, some of these niggas... <laughs> Kendrick Perkins is wild as shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? But, but, but look, look, yeah, yeah, you don't think these niggas on payroll, man? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it'd be over the top sometimes, though. You know what I, I, mean? I don't think they on payroll. I just think they know if they keep if they keep that nigga name in his mouth, they're like, they're going to they're gonna have a job. Yep. Yeah. NBA checks, the NBA yeah, checks that's out, real. so... If if they if if they keep missing LeBron, that's that's the way you enter the studio every time. Yeah, because like even if even if you think about it just like that, like we, we could talk about Kendrick Crackers and we could talk about Shannon Sharp. Shannon Sharp, Shannon Sharp is a Hall of Fame NFL football player. Right, right, and he right. talks about he talks about LeBron and he rides LeBron and he <laughs> like is on the LeBron train, LeBron's the goat to him. And like we talk about Shannon Sharp, but this nigga Kendrick Perkins is remotely uh like a recognizable face on TV now, and it's fucking Kendrick Perkins. Like, who did what for who? Like, I mean, like, if you look at his roster, I mean, his yeah. his resume as opposed to Shannon Sharp's, like, there's no way, like, we should continue consistently have, like, Kendrick Perkins on talking about sport, uh, talking about, I mean. I don't listen to, like, sports center no more. I, <laughs> I hate their like, It's all, like, clickbait and, and yeah. shit. And- and you and you can even tell like when they, when you watch them debate, it's not even about like trying to make the most sense. It's about like who was the most like controversial. You know, it's, you know what I'm saying? They're like like who who has the cra- who has the most craziest takes? That's what that should really be about. Mm-hmm. But uh, one thing I want to say because I, I heard this on the radio today, and I just want to hear like why I don't because like I think Jordan is the goat, like hands down, right? But like why is it that people are trying to say LeBron is? Not because of basketball, but because of off the field. Like, why is niggas moving the goalposts and shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, people basically try to say, like, now LeBron should be in the GOAT because of what he's done off the field. I'm like, nigga, What's we talking the greatest basketball player of all time. Like, yeah, like, all what you, if that's the case, shit, fucking, like, there was a lot of niggas that used to be, like, back in the Civil Rights, like, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, all them niggas yeah. was out there, like, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean. What's, hold on, what's LeBron what's done? Huh? What is LeBron done? Off, Off the field, he had the I Promise School. Okay, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah, man, he he. Can't he, say he, he be sending man. all he be sending all the tweets out and stuff. But are you saying you're the goat? What the goat basketball player? Because if I'm talking about basketball player, that's what they're saying. They're saying that they would they would literally say they would put Dre. I mean, like Draymond said it. <laughs> he said he would put LeBron above uh, uh, Jordan all time because of what he's done off the field. And of course, it's from Draymond. Of course, his bum ass. But I've heard, I've heard other people say it. that's just the one that was like, "All right, enough of this shit." Like I was like, "I can't hear this." No I wonder if that's also y'all, like y'all people, crazy. Um, people living in being products of the moment, though. Like, I mean, I understand, like, because this this might be weird, but I feel like some people probably didn't even like really recognize and see Jordan at his true greatness, and because of so, and like we're living in the LeBron era. And, like, yes, LeBron has done some great things on the court, 17 years and, and some more stuff. But, uh, like, he's also been uh, outspoken. Damn, out, 17 years? Out, outside of sports. But I, I, I don't understand. I don't even like the comparison of, like, trying to put him in. I mean, like, trying to compare, like, who is the GOAT. Like, the GOAT is the GOAT. The GOAT is the person that changed the, the fucking – Every how we look at like fashion and like different things of, along that nature. Jordan. So I, I think Jordan. That's. Jordan. I don't know how you not look at a documentary and say like this nigga not the go. Right. Like how? how I mean, much? shit. I probably I think it's more people. I think it's probably more than it, for more people walking around right now that would probably put Kobe above LeBron. I mean, you just. So I'm talking about as of right now, but I, I mean, I think the talent-wise, LeBron is better, but I think that if legacy-wise, you could put Kobe above him. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, I, I, that's, my, that's my top three. I go Jordan and Kobe, and then LeBron, dog. The, 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 the thing about uh, Kobe and LeBron and, uh, and, and putting them – and uh, the Jordan Kobe conversation is because Kobe and LeBron have said themselves that they are, you know what I mean, they are the dude. But when you ask Jordan who the GOAT is, Jordan's going to defer. He's going to say, oh, I'm not going to put myself in that position. I'm going to say Magic. I'm going to say Will. I'm going to say Julius Irving. If you ask LeBron and, and, and 
ain't supposed to. They automatically said, oh, I'm the girl. And that shit just rubbed me the wrong way. Wait, you said LeB- LeBron and Kobe said I'm the GOAT? Yeah, LeBron, LeBron, said, that. LeBron said that uh, the last Joni D one, that put him that put him ahead, and that makes him. Oh, yeah. That one so right there made me the greatest player of all time. For That's so many I felt. reasons. I was super, super ecstatic to win one for Cleveland because of the 52-year drought. Like, I was ecstatic. Like, obviously, I showed that, that the first wave of emotion was when y'all, everyone saw me crying. Like, that was all for 52 years of everything in sports going on in Cleveland. And then after I stopped, I was like, that one right there made you the greatest player of all time. You know, everybody was just talking how they were the greatest team of all time. Like, they was the greatest team to ever assembled. And for us to come back, you know, the way we came back in that fashion, I was like, you did, you did something special. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, then yeah, Kobe, yeah. and Kobe said, Kobe said, it's me, it's Will, it's Jordan. And that's what he said. This also go back to that. Uh, I think this might, I don't know. I was about to say this might go back to that little competitive edge, though, where you always try to put yourself as the best player alive, regardless of like. Okay, but Jordan knew he was the best man on the planet, but still never put himself in that position. I know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> but Kobe and and LeBron both say, uh, "Yeah, we grew up watching Jordan. Uh, Jordan was that nigga. Jordan." Uh, no, they said no. They said they were the goat. Say yeah, but, they but still, they, they both always, everybody always defer to Jordan like, oh, yeah. Uh, everybody else after Jordan anyway, they always defer to that shit. They saying, uh, yeah, I was watching Jordan and that's why I, I was doing this move or whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> they know Jordan is that man. They know. <laughs> they know. <laughs> I mean, they fuck. That's why they said this shit because they had like some type of complex within them. And they yeah. Shit. Yeah. No disrespect to Kobe, RIP, but that nigga knew. I think that's more of a. Well, I was gonna say I think that's that's more that should be more of the comparison of like Kobe versus LeBron as opposed to like trying to even put um, Jordan. I mean, putting Jordan in that category. What you mean, Al? The nigga said I'm better than him. No, I'm saying, I'm saying, like, you know how, like, they... Hold on, hold on. Who said like, I'm better than him? Kobe <laughs> said I'm the GOAT. I am the GOAT. I am the GOAT. I'm the greatest of all time. Nah, I was just saying, like, you know how, like, not necessarily we, but, like, the same way Marcus brought it up, whereas, though, uh, like, Draymond said it on, on, on the radio or said it in his interview where he was talking about, like, LeBron, so I think the conversation shouldn't be like LeBron and Jordan being who is the GOAT. It should be like who who is the better player between like um, Kobe and LeBron. They're the greatest of their time. I think even just the whole conversation is ridiculous. Yeah. Just to me, you know, and, and it might it might just be ESPN just trying to keep LeBron's like, you know, um uh, prestige high by just putting them comparing them to Jordan. Like, cause it's like I'm, they they ask this who's the goat conversation like every fucking two months like it's like that shit never goes away you know what I'm saying like something made a difference in the last two months yeah that's what I'm saying they just keep they just trying to keep that shit in like the the general consciousness just to make it seem like LeBron is up there with Jordan I, I don't think it's a I don't even think that shit's a conversation like I think that's I think it's a crazy conversation I agree yeah. I agree yeah. And they Jordan were, went to the finals six, six times. out of six times. Yeah, won the job. Uh, how many finals MVPs? How many defensive player of the year? He, he was defensive player of the year the same year he won MVP. Uh, nigga averaged like thirty some points off fifty percent shooting. Come on, bro. Yeah, definitely agree. The nigga still got niggas trying to shoot like it ain't nothing. Huh? I said the nigga still got niggas still re-releasing shoes like it ain't nothing. Still yeah. got. Outside buying shoes, like yeah. I just bought them joints. I just bought them them Jordan hairs. I just bought them joints. You got them female joints? Yeah, they got them joints. They got them joints. Them joints, though. 